What's up guys, this is Massey, welcome to another video. In this video I want to show you how to expand x plus 1 over x to the power of 6 using binomial theory. So if you want to expand it, the answer is going to be 6c0 x to the power of 6 times 1 over x to the power of 0 plus 6c1 x to the power of 5, 1 over x to the power of 1, plus 6c2, x to the power of 4, 1 over x to the power of 2, plus 6c3, x to the power of 3, 1 over x to the power of 3, plus 6c4, x to the power of 2, 1 over x to the power of 4, plus 6 c 5 x to the power of 1 1 over x to the power of 5 and finally 6 c 6 x to the power of 0 times 1 over x to the power of 6 so as you see here the exponent for the first term is reducing 5 6 5 4 3 2 1 0 and the exponent of 1 over x is increasing 0 1 2 3 4 5 6 it's going up then what we have here, the number of terms, since the index is 6, it's supposed to be 7. So it's always one more. So that's going to be, we need to simplify it, but we need to calculate the coefficient first. If we want to calculate NCR, we need to use this formula, N factorial over R factorial N minus R factorial. Or we have another way to do that. We need to use Pascal triangle using this row. And the 7x coefficient is going to be 1, 6, 15, 20, 15, 6, 1. 1, 6, 15, 20, 5, 15, 6, 1. So there are 7 terms. So we just submit for these 7 terms in here. So let's start simplifying. So this one is 1. 1 over x to the power of 0 is 1 as well. So it's just going to be, the first term is going to be just x to the power of 6. Next one is 6 times x to the power of 5 times 1 over x. Third term is going to be 15. x to the power of 4, 1 over x squared. This one is going to be 20. x cubed times 1 over x cubed plus 15 x squared times 1 over x to the power of 4 plus 6 x times 1 over x to the power of 5 and finally 1 times 1 because x to the power of 0 is 1 1 over x to the power of 6 so when you simplify it that's going to be x to the power of 6 plus 6x to the power of 4, because x to the power of 5 divided by x is going to be x to the power of 4. 15, x to the power of 4 divided by x squared is going to be x squared. x cubed divided by x cubed is going to be 1, so it's just 20. x squared divided by x to the power of 4 is going to be x squared, so it's 15 over x squared. 6x over x to the power of 5 is going to be 6 over x to the power of 4. And finally, 1 over x to the power of 6. So that's going to be the final answer after expansion using binomial theorem. I hope you enjoyed this video. Please leave me a comment if you have any question. Please don't forget to subscribe to this channel. You can have access to many other videos regarding this topic, which is binomial theorem and other topics in math, chemistry, and physics. Thank you for watching and have a great day.